To get the frog poison into the bloodstream, the matses first burn through the barrier of the skin with a smouldering stick. The more burns, the stronger the dose. Piers and Richard opt for eight, and the rest of the tribe have only two more. It's all a bit macho, David. Sure, it's a bit macho. But what can you do? It's sort of a macho culture. The dried poison is mixed with the saliva of the tribe's best hunter and then smeared onto the open burns. The effects are fairly instantaneous. Oh, you can tell it's a poison. Oh, and my heart, my heart is starting to beat. All of the things I'm coming across seem to be a lot about purging, a lot about vomiting. Take something in, heave it out again. And it seems to be something to do with heaving out, not just the poison that you've taken, but also getting rid of bad energies, generally uh, cleansing your system to make you stronger. Mr. Toad's wild ride. Just kick my ass. After 25 minutes, the purging is almost over. Oh, oh boy, there's a lot of vomiting going on around here. <laughs> the afternoon is spent in recovery, but the sapo has brought tensions to the surface.